So someone asked me if I could uh, do an install video for the Reshade 3.0 and which Reshade is this again? I believe it's the E3 2017. Uh, that is correct. Uh, I would have done Plathos or Pathos, Pathos, ENB. I probably am butchering the pronunciation. It's the same mod author who does the ENB for my Fallout you might have seen, but I misplaced one of the files like an asshole. So we're going to use this. So the first thing is first, we hit the Reshade setup. And we go to DirectX 3. Oh, sorry. First up, oh, we're already at Witcher. So, obviously, I've done this before. But we're going to go here to Witcher. You know where your file is. Steam apps, common, Witcher 3, bin, 64, x64. Could be different for you because mine is in the D drive, if I recall correctly. Select Rendering API. Uh, do you wish? Yes. We click that for everything. And we are done. Okay, hit. I'm going to hit OK because I'm an asshole because it doesn't matter anyway because we're going to go in here reshade shaders we're going to delete that immediately and then we're going to put in this reshade shader let's see there we go now the important part is number seven go into the folder where your witcher uh, 3 exe is located and delete the d311 and d311.dll if you have one of them from previous reshades and rename them to DX, DI, and DX, DI, DLL, which you already see right here that I've done. If you have that, if not, then I guess don't worry about it, but that applied to me, so it made sense to me. After we've gone to that, we should have just, or I should have just clicked and dragged these in right there, off the bat, into the game. And we're done here. All right, let's get going with The Witcher, huh? This is probably going to be one of my worst install mods ever. If I even put this up, I feel that it is not worthy of my fan base. God, fan base. What a weird fucking phrase for me. You know what I'm saying? Me. Fans. Yeah, right. If my high school teacher could see me now. I finally got Witcher running. Sometimes it's a real pain in the balls. Hopefully that uh, Windows 10 program for gaming works. Oh, sorry. So next we hit F2. Okay, here's what we want to do. Now, when you hit F2, you'll see these options. They won't pop up naturally. I see you gather before oh, me. Oh, holy shit. Hungry. I'm such an asshole. Okay, so I had to redo the audio again. I totally forgot that I didn't adjust the sound in-game for Witcher so I could do voiceovers while recording and shadow play at the same time. Ain't that a bitch, right? Now, when you press F2, you're going to see the menu bar where that little arrow is and you see me clicking at it. Normally that'll be blank, but since I've done this before and it's a reshade I've used, it's still kind of there by default. Henceforth, you click that little arrow and you're gonna see options for the any files that you have put inside of your Witcher folder where your exe is, or the x64 folder. And it'll give you the choice between sharpened Witcher or unsharpened in Toussaint. Now, obviously, whichever is your proclivity, whether it's sharpened in the normal Witcher game or unsharpened, and obviously Toussaint is for Toussaint. The only problem I can say that I have with the sharpened version is it kind of gives you a cartoony look, just slightly. Kind of like Borderlands style. Just slightly. If you're into that, that's totally cool. But, you know, come say, come sa, mama makusa, as Mo Michael Jackson said. What the hell does that mean? I don't know. Or was it mama say, mama sa, mama makusa? Well, anyway, hopefully this is able to help you in your journey in using the new 3.0 reshade. I'm pretty sure that all other reshades that use 3.0 are exactly like this. I mean, so far that I've seen they are, even in other games. So once you figure it out here, you can do it in Deus Ex or Mafia 3, so on and so forth. Uh, Battlefield 1, even though I don't really recommend it because you can do it, but I don't know if EA will hammer you for cheating or hacking because the DLL files are DX, and you know what I mean, right? So, hopefully this has helped you. I hope the fact that the game already had this stuff set up in my folders didn't throw anyone off or make it seem easier than it actually may. Because it's not that hard, believe me. It's really not that hard to get a grasp of. Trust me when I say that. If I can do it, you can do it. Trust me. Believe me, dude. I'm like Naruto, okay? I'm doing hand jutsu signs right now. Well, anyway, that's going to do it for me. Hopefully this has helped you. Uh, I can't actually give more of a fuck than me. Rate, comment, subscribe. You so choose. If not, that's cool for me. Adios, bichachos. And sorry for so many videos today.